Alright y'all, it's your boy LSR254. And we back with another one. As you can see, uh engine is in. Well, engine was in last time. But yeah, we got our spark plug wires. Yes sir, yes sir. Uh, spark plug wires. I wanted the blue to complement the rest of them. The uh, one up here. Uh, G plus throttle body. Uh, got the PSI harness. Installed on there. got some factory wires that need to be ran they already connected to the starter starters connected all that good jazz uh, let's see here yeah got the AC box back together all new stuff in there, heater core, evaporator, lower motor, resistor, and the relay. A new condenser, new radiator, new oil cooler, everything, everything been touched. Uh, show you what we got here. I uh, got a battery in there. M made some battery cables out of zero gauge. Got a the positive. They're both black, so I had to put red on one just so I don't ever confuse myself. Uh, I got the negative there. Got to hook it up. Uh, well, it's hooked up. We're going to see. We'll make sure we got lights set for the crank over. The rest of the harness is ran here on the inside. And we got a computer. All right, that's where the computer would be. Fuse box, OBD2, and all the rest of that stuff. None of that's hooked up yet. But we'll get to it. Like I said, we're just doing the basics. See if we got some lights at least. Alright, alright. First time ever. Seeing the LS bro hand lit up from the back side. Side markers in there. I think we still got a hookup. I think the bulbs up here is bad. Don't have the headlights in there, so those ain't gonna come on. But the bag is intact. Lit up like a Christmas tree. All right, let me try this. I don't know if I got that starter wire on there tight enough. We got progress, y'all. So yeah. 
one step closer. She in there, she turning over. Uh, what am I waiting on? Waiting on knock sensors. Uh, once my knock sensors get here, then I can go ahead and finish uh, putting those up there under the uh, under the intake manifold. Uh, yeah, yeah. So those get done. Put them under the intake uh, intake manifold. Hook them up. Uh, still got to run the fuel to it. Well, no, the fuel. Well, the fuel is ran, uh, but we have to run the wires back to our pump. Uh, I was trying to run it through the. Uh, I was trying to run it through the stock stuff, but uh, I'm gonna go ahead and bypass all that. Um, and just run the wires straight back there, like I did on every other build I've done. done to the colors and the C10. Let's run our own wire back there for the fuel. Um, I know where the wire starts. Well, of course, yeah, it starts there, comes into the trunk. You can't see back there, but it comes back there. So, probably going to end up running it uh, just inside the car to the relay over there. But uh, yeah, she is. Let me see. I'm surprised the battery gauge is working. I don't know if I had everything hooked up the way it need to be, but. Look like that's probably right. Well, let's see what else we got over here. The radio, I don't know if it worked. We gonna leave it in here. We ain't gonna take it out. Let's just keep the OG look. Got the equalizer on there, scan the seat, sets. All that good stuff. Uh, she's turning over though. <laughs> well, pop go to Wheeler, because the Wheeler go pop. Stay one step closer, y'all. Just keep y'all in the loop. Appreciate y'all support with the memberships and everything. I say these videos also go out to the public. You know what I'm saying? Won't be hitting 10,000, but I want to give y'all the, the first looks, first cranks, and all that good stuff, man. So. Till the next time, it's your boy, LSRI254. Remember, identify your weaknesses, make it your strength. Like with all about choices, choose wisely and productivity over procrastination. And remember, the hustle don't stop, the grind don't stop. Gone.